this is a post. In a new post, in a video. Okay, what is this? Water, okay. And what does the water come from? Where does the water come from? Sorry? Okay, no. Water from the rain, yeah, that's okay. And where are the holes for the water to get into here? No. I mean, we have a big hole in the middle, but this is not for the water to come in. This is, yes. Yeah, left and right, okay? Left and right, you have the water in comes. So the water comes from those corners into this, which is called, how do you call this space in Spanish? A place for collecting rainwater from the roofs. Aljibe. Okay, that's the word in Spanish. Aljibe. And how do you say it? Pero por lo menos lo ha visto y lo ha dicho. Eso se llama ser observador. How do you say aljibe in English? Aljibe. Casi la Sí, como el post. Entre el aljibe y el post, no hacemos uno, ¿eh? Okay, how do you call? How do you call in Spanish? What you have in the bathroom and you push for the water to flash when you go to have number one and number two. <laughs> okay, how do you call inside the toilet when you, you pull the bottle for the water to but how do you call the place where you have the water? Focus. 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 You sit down in the toilet. You have pee or poo, and after having pee or poo, you put a bottle and the water flash down. How do you call this? Come on. No, that's... Okay, listen, listen, listen. That's where your things go. But how do you call the place where you have the water for flashing and... Pero como se llama? Okay? So, if you say que pozo se dice pos y arriba se dice alji, how would you say cisterna in English? Thank you very much. So, this is a sister in English. Okay? In English, we call this a sister. Okay? Why? Because alji is a word that comes from Arabic. Okay? And from Arabic, we took the word for this. But in English, they call this sister. Okay, a sister is a place where we have collected the rain water from the patio and the roof up there. And how do we call the hole for taking the water with buckets? How do you say it in Spanish? Pozo. Okay, how do you say how do you say pozo in English? Pozo. Well, well. Okay, how do you say how how do you sorry how do you say bien in English? Well, that's it. Thank you. That's the same word for pofo in English. Well. So pofo in English is well. well. And you write it the same way. W E double L. Well is pofo in English. Particularly the post, no se olvida. Well. So actually, this is the, the hole that we usually call the well, and we threw the buckets, los cubos, for taking the water. The water comes through that. And this is the biggest cistern we have in Cáceres. The total capacity of this cistern is around 2 million liters of no, water. <laughs> I say that the maximum capacity is 2 million liters of water. It doesn't mean that we have 2 million now. We only have 2 meters of water, which means, let's say, 20% of the total capacity. So, what's 20% of 2 million? What's 20% of 20 million? 20,000 or? 400,000. 400,000. 400,000 liters we have now in here. If you look opposite, you can see the marks of the water. Can you see on the wall there at the end? So you can see how this system has had 
different levels of water. The maximum is where you see the green part, okay? This is the highest. We have this system. This system was never full completely. So, although the total capacity is 2 million liters, we've never seen this complete ever, ever, never, ever in the life, okay? Um, where's the friend who talked about the San Francisco Javier? What did you say was the day when the church was began? Okay, so if the church was begun in 1698, and usually this is the first thing they made, we tend to think this is from 1698, and then the rest of the church was um, uh, completed or finished on that branch. Okay?